Good morning, happy Monday. What do you want? It's 11 and she thinks it's 12 because I'm sitting at the table working. So I think she's assuming it's time for her yogurt. She's getting desperate. She's even hitting. A new post up on my site. I am going to put the link here for anyone who wants to uh, read it. It is about my favorite collection. I showed it a few days ago. That spongeware with the gold. So I'm going to put that link here. I will also have a new post up here shortly of my woodland type fireplace look that I just shared a couple days ago. That will be up on my site as well. So I'll share that once that's done. And I wanna share a few things, a few pillows that I grabbed from Target. And I can't help myself. I'm not sure what Deb is doing today. I do know she's already played that game a couple times and she kept going, okay, one more because I lost. Okay, one more because I lost. Somebody wanted the, a couple people did, actually wanted the name of it. Once she gets home, I will share that. And Deb had made a turkey last week, so we had some leftover that I was like, I can't eat anymore. And Deb, Deb's not a fond lover of turkey. So <clears throat> she took that down to her parents and made mashed potatoes. And I don't even know why I'm telling you that. I think that's why I was telling you that. I'm gonna get the name of that game from her once she gets back from her parents' house. From taking that food down anyways the somebody stopped early this morning i think it was around 6 30 and i think it was probably some of the crew to check out to see if it's too wet and it i think it's too wet because they didn't stay so my guess is it's too wet it rained so much last week so hopefully not we're getting to tell you this too so there's just so many fun things coming up and I keep, those toys are driving me. Better <laughs> That rocker's got to go outside. Anyways, um, Deb just got done putting it together a couple nights ago and we haven't moved some things on the porch to get it out. But not only is our new house going to be started, I already told you these two things yesterday. Our new website is going to be done hopefully in the next couple of weeks. We are getting a few antique pieces, uh, probably in the next couple of weeks, I would guess. So stay tuned for that. I know you're probably not excited about this, but I am. We're going to be getting our labs back probably in, I would say the end of this week, early next. And we will go meet with the compounding pharmacist. If you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, check out my hormone highlight, but I cannot wait to see what is going on because something is going on with both of us. Also, in the next couple of weeks, we are going to be starting our garden. We're already talking about what we want our raised beds to look like. I've told you this before several times that everything on our property, we want to be low maintenance, maintenance free, as easy as it can be. So we're definitely going with raised garden beds, but we're looking into different types and designing it all out there so when you pull in our driveway the pond is there and then back beyond the pond is where we're going to have our garden so that's coming up we are going to probably be doing that in the next couple of weeks this a couple of days ago <clears throat> we may be moving i'm waiting on the phone call uh, moving a building out there as well so stay tuned for that. There's so many fun things. It's wood, Wodoku. W-O-O-D-O-K-U. If you like puzzles, <clears throat> you're gonna love it. I'll type it on here. emails and DMs trying to get some answered and I just got this one. Yes, I shared for seed. I think it was the end of last week maybe. If you are looking for 
an excellent probiotic. Theirs is the best that I found. It's actually a prebiotic and a probiotic, and it is called uh, DS01 Daily Symbiotic. I'm gonna put my um, link and my code here, but it's the one that it has the, it's a capsule within a capsule. The prebiotic is the outer capsule. The probiotic is the inner capsule. The outer capsule actually protects the probiotic and it takes the probiotic all the way to your colon. So you get all of the probiotic there, which is mind boggling to me. So anyways, I'm going to put my link here, Deb and D. I'll type it on here. Somebody just asked me in a DM if I, Deb and I play the game Wordle, I think it's called. It's where you solve a puzzle per day or something. I said, yeah, that, that would not go over. I am a really good speller. Deb, however, she has to ask me how to spell the simplest of words. She just, she, she just can't. And she's very competitive and I don't care. So I can just see me sitting there going, done. <laughs> she would be so angry every time. I told you guys I was going to show you a few things that I grabbed from Target, but before I do, I did want to point out this is one thing that I found when we were in North Carolina in one of the antique malls, and it was a really good price. I love it. Sorry about that. Our accountant called, so that's always really fun. Um, I wanted to show you this topiary. I've had this for several weeks and totally forgot to share it with you, and unfortunately, it is not in in stock anymore at Target. But I did a quick search and Wesley has a couple of these. I think the large one may be out of stock, but there's a smaller like this. I love it because I think it looks so lifelike. It comes in a really nice pot. And like I said, I love how it just looks like it is a real one. That is always my must whenever I do artificial plants. I'm going to link his here. I have a little tip for you regarding artificial plants. I've already, I've given up. I've already told you a million times I cannot have live plants. I just can't. But one thing that I love to do is still add a saucer underneath artificial plants because that makes them even look more real. Um, and I do that a lot. So as I did with this and this one. And I shared this cute little fern the other day. This is also from the Nested Fig. I love him. He looks so real. I've had him for a long, long time. And they're inexpensive. I'm going to pull the link and put this here. And these are the pillows that I got at Target. They are like this, I don't know, window pane type thing. They have a cute little ruffle all around it. They do have a zipper. So I put my own insert in that I love. I'll link the pillow in the previous story and then I'll link the insert that I love here. Um, but they're really soft and I think they're really cute. They come in a couple of different colors as well. Look, I took my parents some lunch today and my mom gave me my birthday present. Now you know where I get the homemade cards at. Now look closely. <laughs> I think that's supposed to be a cheerleader with two pom-poms. <laughs> Where we are, we had to get not one, <laughs> but two. So now we have a total of three. Yes. This right here is why we need two. This right here is where you're going to sleep tonight. <laughs> that's the bathtub. And we have to get... A 50 or wait a 72 inch vanity and a 42 inch vanity all of our sinks faucets utility sinks kitchen sink uh, countertop for the vanities all have to go in here and it's temporary We recently started using Necessaire body products. I just put on the serum and the body lotion. They are excellent. 
they make your skin so soft and they are clean ingredients, which I love. I'm going to be sharing more details soon, but I'm excited because they did give me a code if you want to check it out yourself. Uh, for 10% off, use my code, tap through this link. I'm thoroughly impressed.